Ukraine's army is pulling military hardware, including artillery and tanks, closer to Donbas. Russia permanent representative at the Organization for Security and Cooperation in Europe, Andriy Kelin, said on Thursday after a meeting of the OEC Permanent Council. Over the past few days, from November 6 to November 9, we have information about seven cases when the army vehicles were pulled to Donbas, he said. There are strong fights for the Nikishina village in Donetsk People's Republic today. Armed forces of Ukraine attacking village. Forces of DPR giving them payback. The seventh Russian humanitarian aid convoy for eastern Ukraine is ready, the press service of the Russian Emergencies Ministry said Friday. Another humanitarian aid convoy for Donbas has been prepared by Russian Emergencies Ministry. All cargo is headed to Donetsk and Lugansk, the press service said. The U.S. Congress has a role to play in ensuring military readiness for the United States to more effectively deter Russia. Congress plays a role in looking at what our current state of military readiness is and what we're doing with our European allies to deter or try to deter Vladimir Putin. I think we have a role there, said Congressman Rob Whitman on Virginia. The congressman believes that Russian troops were moving through Ukraine like NATO report. Does he believe in favors and trolls? We don't know. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our YouTube channel to receive up-to-date news on situation in Ukraine.